Hello and welcome to That Bad Dad. Over the Christmas holidays, I had asked for a Creality Ender 3 3D printer for my son and I, Jackson. Uh, we received that for Christmas. We started it up and did the regular printings, uh, the Little Rabbit, stuff like that. And one of the things I've always been interested in is Aztec life. Uh, it just has always intrigued me. And I know somebody had created this thing called an Aztec death whistle off of a design that was actually made by the Aztecs. This is what it looks like. It's a pretty neat whistle. Uh, if you saw one of these in real life, it'd be clay, um, be older. You blow in the top of the head like that. The sound comes out of the back there and a large amount of wind comes out of the bottom, but the sound comes out of the back. These would have been used uh, either, they think in wartime, where you would have a camp of a few thousand Aztecs or a few hundred Aztecs gonna be committing a raid and they'd blow on these at night before they did that or during the raid itself this would have been not a nice sound to hear. They also found these held in the hands of a sacrificial young man who had his head cut off in front of a, a temple for their wind god. I'm gonna have the sounds going now. Um, wrong side, still learning a lot of this. The sounds are gonna be going in here uh, in the names of the language they used and the wind god they used right there. I could never say those words. The sounds you're going to hear now are me blowing at the desk. Let's try this several ways. I removed the mic from my neck piece, which is over here. Let's see how it sounds now. That's a very low blow. And it can change if you put your hand over the bottom too. Interesting. And blowing on the other side of my basement behind a couple of walls and some wood, stairs, etc. When it's close to you, you're going to hear a really throaty wind style. It's not that scary, but it's really loud. Um, which is not something that you would look at and go, that's scary. But then you get into another room and you record away and you listen to the recording and you can hear the screaming. Once again, I'm not a professional Aztec person on this um, and nobody's really heard this, but this is the best sound they can come up with uh, blowing into the old clay whistles and listening to the old clay ones versus the new 3D printed ones in, this is just a PETG plastic, sounds remarkably similar. Anyways, this is an Aztec death whistle. If you do have a 3D printer, go to, create, go to any one of the sites that are out there. They all have this one model. It takes about four hours to print. Totally worth a lot of fun. Have a great day. If you enjoyed this video, like and subscribe. The button can be found right down here. We'll be printing a lot more like this. We'll also be doing a lot of lasering, as you see in the previous videos we've done. Uh, and let us know if you'd like to see anything. show you what it sounds like sorry just learning how to put my like and subscribe it'll be uh i'm gonna leave now i'm gonna leave now and i'm gonna try this around the corner see if what it sounds like far away stay tuned welcome thank you for hello and welcome to that bad dad today we're going to talk about the aztec death whistle that i printed up and that doesn't have to be right in front of my face that's about all it's good for that and scaring the hell out of my kids on a regular basis if I can. Good morning, everybody. It's uh, Tuesday or Monday.